your partner, round we go, doing a square dance in the snow. Other way now, but not too fast. Got to make this hold out last. Don't you do, and do you do? Plenty of dancing left for you. Clap your hands and stop your feet. This holiday hold out can't be beat. downstairs and we gave the program in between the poles, you know, <laughs> and uh, and then we moseyed upstairs and we've been here for a good six years probably. Our very first program for me with the kids was in 2007, 2007, and we just so happened to do the Sam John Jacobson play that we're doing tonight. <coughs> So it's kind of like starting out and ending off with, the, with Santa's holiday hoedown. And so back in the day, in 2007, we had eight students. And I don't think Ian, or Ethan is here no. tonight, Ethan? No. Okay, Ethan is a junior? Yes. He's the tallest member of their family. <laughs> and he was a first grader, okay? And then we had, um, we had, Tanner and Cullen and Hannah and Faith, Rebecca and Sam Luther, and who am I missing? Katie Lynn, that's right. So, um, Joshua. Yes. So we had eight, and there were 22 character parts, and eight kids did 22 <laughs> parts, and it was like two and three characters. But we now, have 22 kids, and uh, so we've grown, and uh, they each have a part. So we're really, really excited to do this show for you tonight. If you look at your program, the first page will be our sing-along, and so we'd like you all to join in singing these Christmas carols. We'll have a variety of different students playing piano, and then the procedure is that after they play, then we'll sing. And then we'll clap after we're done singing, and they'll wait for one to play piano. Okay, so that's how we'll do that. And then we'll have a little break for door prizes. That's tradition. And, um, and then, if you turn the page, it tells the cast members of Santa's Holiday Hoda. And... Then the next page talks about scene one and scene two and the music that we do for that. And then there's a section of special thanks. And I want to thank, just take the time to read that. There's so many people that have, uh, especially parents and family um, with props and costumes and all that kind of thing. I want to especially thank Tanya and Chris Dietz. Um, our flag at school was getting kind of tattery. And they had donated that some years back, and they donated another brand new big flag. So I thank you very much for that. Um, so I also want to be sure to thank my co-teachers, yeah, Miss Katie Daly and Miss, Mrs. Becky Griffin. Um, and we couldn't do the whole show without a team effort. 
Then if you'll go ahead and, and turn to the next couple pages have the words to the songs, so please sing along. And then the last few pages is our family traditions. <laughs> Every year the students have something that they we put special in the program for their thoughts and that at Christmas time. This time we got the, the moms and the dads, the grandparents and aunts and uncles and all involved. And you have the family traditions and they're very, very interesting. I think I've gotten a few good ideas. Um, I, I probably won't do the oysters in the stocking thing. <laughs> <Just say it. laughs> the can of oysters in the stocking, that's pretty cool. Um, but very interesting. So take time this weekend or whatever to, to read through the family traditions. Uh, downstairs, besides bathrooms, I guess that just don't work. You know, we've been here since Tuesday and we've held school and we've done a practice. And the kids really enjoyed that. So Tuesday and Wednesday, and then today, they were here. So we probably put a lot of toilet paper in that system. <laughs> so anyway, and it just started doing its thing just now, a long time. But anyway, sorry about that. Downstairs, we have refreshments afterwards, and we have a silent auction. So get to pick up some <coughs> Anything else, Ms. Daly? We good? We are going to start out <clears throat> with Cassie Boyd playing piano, O oh, Come All You Faithful. Thank you. 
favorite songs is Silent Night, and they do American Sign. <laughs>
next song is Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer with Max Griffin playing the piano. <coughs>
We've heard there's a fortune to be made in a place called Branson, Missouri, and we're fixing to head down there and check it out. Fix it? Yeah, Chief. That sounds risky. I'm fixing it down there and open theater. That's what's busted for theater. I put on a show. A show? We don't know anything about show business. Yes. As the first lady of the North Pole, I think this is a problem that I can tackle. That's why she's the president. I mean the first lady. Well, Mrs. Boss, I do have a lot of frequent flyer plans racked up for the past 250 years. I said if we can manage a Saturday night stay over and get back before the holiday blackout, we should give it a try. Yeah! Get there, everybody can. Yeah! Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so let's pack our rhinestones and get going.
artificial intelligence. Don't forget handsome, guys. Don't forget handsome. <laughs> handsome and humble corner of country western shows and all pranks. Ooh, ah, wow. Text. These folks are a bunch of reindeer and, and elves? Elvis? Elvis is here? Not <laughs> Elvis, boss. Elvis. Elvis will be a big hit in France.
But what you may need is some feminine anemone. Some feminine anemone. Some feminine. A girl! Not to be. Oh, wow. A girl? It ought to be someone with a lot of stage experience. Not. Too bad Dolly Holiday isn't available. Yeah, she's the greatest. Dolly Holiday? Well, hello, boys. <laughs> Dolly's back in town. <laughs> Dolly, these cats from up north want to open a theater and put on a highly profitable show, but need a real lady to add some class to their production. Have you got any ideas of who might be available? Well, it just so happens that I got some time on my hands. I'll be glad to help you out. I knew you'd come through, Dolly. You're the greatest. It's never TG. Besides, you know, I'll always love you. <laughs> Gee, I don't know, Mr. Glitter, if this is exactly the kind of image that he was wanting to show to save his toy shop. Relax, pal. You want to make it big here in Branson? You gotta be willing to take a few risks once in a while. That's right, Shorty. If you want to make it big, you gotta be willing to play all of the <laughs>
I like to pose your right. I guess we're still short one headliner. Hmm. Oh dear, Santa's going to be so disappointed. He sure is. Santa who? What do you mean, Santa who? Just what I said. Who? Who? Santa who will be disappointed? Ho, ho, ho! As in up on the house top, <coughs> click, click, click! As in cute red suit and shiny black boots! <laughs> of course we know Santa! We are boss! Well, what do you little fellas worry about? You got one of the greatest entertainers of all time right in your own corral! Are you sure? Do you think that Santa will be a big draw here in Branson, even with his classical training? Are you kidding me? This will be the biggest hit ever since the Easter Bunny did the, that stand-up comedy routine in Caesar's Palace back in 66. Yay! Yeah. No kidding? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Um... 
featuring Golly Holiday, Christmas Elvises, <laughs> Rudolph the Red Nose, Horse, and the main headliner himself, Santa Claus. Downstairs and a silent talk. 
discussion. So, thank you very much.